Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Seth Chavez, and I play Esperanza Spooner Cruz on DC Legends of Tomorrow. Just say the word and I'll blow into kingdom come. You know, I do love that she is just a fearless character and she's not afraid of the unknown. And that's something that I admire because I'm not like that. Look, I spent my whole life trying not to let aliens into my head. And now to try to save your girlfriend, I've got them all in there, which is no freaking picnic. It was so much fun playing her. As someone who has layers, she believes that the world was cruel, and then she sort of faces her own fears. And within that, within within doing so, she realizes she finds her strength. You don't know what it feels like when they get in my head. So get into theirs. Let them feel what you're feeling. I relate to that emotionally. You know, I've I've experienced those um, those those feelings. So um, it was nice to be able to sort of bring her to life. Let me through. I, I, I can help. I can help. I think that's my mom. I think the writers are doing a fantastic job. They did something that I've never, it's never happened to me before. Um, they reached out to me and they asked for more background, for more of my background. So they've cherry picked pieces of my mom and they've brought her into my character. Where were you from originally? Los Arenales, El Salvador. My TV mom was raised in the same small town that my mom was 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 raised in. So that was really cool that they sort of made her true to me. It's like me as Lisette and Spooner, so I, we have like such a really cool connection. I was raised in Texas, not hee-ha. I'm the first uh, generation here in America. I grew up with um, I grew up with an family of immigrants. So it was a mixture of both. I adapted with uh, my Salvadorian culture and the American culture. So I'm like in the in-between. <laughs> Maybe I'm not a shoe first, ask questions kind of guy. Huh. Mm, nice. That's great, Spooner. You're working on yourself. I am impressed. Yeah. Why just blot them when you can find out their deepest fears and exploit them? Hmm, Spooner. Now I'm impressed. Yeah, you know, something that fueled me, um, I guess, before becoming uh, an actress and something that I would see on TV is, this, I know it sounds it sounds super like, I would always hear people say, just don't give up. And I swear, I don't know what it was, um, me believing so, the, the idea of not giving up, I didn't think the idea of failing was was an option. So I my, my, my so that's that, that was my thing that carried me. I was like, I just can't give up because if I give up, then, then it's not gonna happen. So I never did. So I, I, I just that it always fueled me. So if I can just pass that message along, just do your research and don't give up. <laughs> All right then. Game on.